They're gonna be right there. That's embarrassing, man. A crawler got a hit off on us. Oh, shit. Another one did. It's really embarrassing. Doubly embarrassing. You know what's better than a double? A triple. Hit us. There we go. We got a triple. Okay. I'm a completionist. Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, uh, we are going to go ahead and do some exploring of the map. Um, we're not going to... It's it's getting close to nighttime, so what we'll do is we'll go out and fly around until it gets too dark to see, unless we can still see, okay, even in the dark. And then uh, we'll come back here, and i gotta I got to fix some some paint boo-boos that I made. <laughs> That's terrible. Uh, so, but uh, let's go ahead and take advantage of the daylight whilst we have it. I just want to check, make sure I got basic stuff. We got ammo, we got food, we got water. Uh, we are going to need gasoline. Um, so, I don't know, let's grab probably two of those is fine. And I think I may have left one up in the gyro. And yeah, let's head out and do some exploration, some map uncovering. Uh, so, the only place I haven't really been in to speak of is the southwest part of our map uh, so let's just look at it real quick um i have been way up in the northeast and i know there's a city there we drove by that at nighttime on the motorcycle but obviously i didn't explore the city so we that's something i want to do we've kind of been into the northwest too um, this is all just desert and then you know the border there uh, but I haven't really been down into the southwest. So let's go ahead and aim for that. Let me look in here. And uh, oh, we, okay, so we already have two more things of fuel. Let's just put all of that fuel in there. And yeah, we should be good to go. Okay. Off we go. So we want to turn and head southwest. We're going to have um, this big mountain range here that we'll have to kind of go over. But I can see the water off to the south, so we're, we're very close to the southern border already as it is. But we'll head over this way and then see what's what it might just be nothing but wasteland uh and if that if it is and that's fine at least we you know what we're dealing with then you know um yeah so how's everybody doing as if you guys can answer me <laughs> well you can in the comments um what the heck's up with alpha 21 man i'm i haven't really been paying that much attention to it and i usually don't um you know, when, when any game, you know, comes out with a major update, whether it's Seven Days to Die or something else, I don't pay real close attention to it until it's getting, like, really, really close to launch. But I don't even know, you know, and maybe you guys don't either. I'm sure a lot of you guys have been following it to some extent. But I don't even know if, if it's even close to launch. If Does anybody even know that? Um, has Have the fun pimps given us a hint? For a date um, one thing I can tell you is that the last time that I remember them taking this long to come out with a new alpha was um, between 16 and 17 they took a huge amount of time to come out with 17 because they made you know so so many major changes to the game at that point um, and I don't know it seems like alpha 21 from what I do know about it is it doesn't seem like it's that big of, a, of an update in terms of changing the game but I could be completely wrong about that so I'm just wondering why it's taken them you know it's been over a year you know since they came out with Alpha 20 so just curious you know if you guys have been following it along uh, following along with that let me know in the comments uh, what you know about that I'd be curious to know but yeah I don't spend a lot of time um, watching videos and in listening to a bunch of people speculate about shit they don't know anything about and they're just you know they're just blabbing um and until i know that the game is is very 
close to come out and then I'm going to, you know, like, like for example, when the developers start doing their developer streams, that's where gonna, when I'm going to start paying a little bit more attention, you know, and I'll watch some of those streams just to kind of get a feel for, you know, what's going to happen. So, okay, so there isn't really anything out here. Uh, we get into a snow biome when we get way into the corner here. And that's all just wasteland behind the mountains, so we know there's not really any compelling reason to go out there unless we found like a huge uh, titanium deposit. That's something we could consider. And I see water over on the... beyond these trees, uh, or beyond this mountain, I should say. Too, so I, I'm pretty much getting the idea that there isn't going to be anything in the extreme southwest. Oh, well, hold on. Maybe we did find a, a snow city over this way. There's definitely a town, if not a city. Um, you know what I'm going to do, though, is I'm going to fly... Let's just crest this mountain peak here, just, to, just so we know for sure we've gone all the way to the border. Because there could be, like, a hidden... A hidden village on the other side of this mountain. I know there probably isn't, but you never know. <laughs> so let's check that out. Yeah, what are you guys looking forward to in Alpha 21? I know we're, you know, we're, we're getting some new weapons and stuff like that, but honestly, I, I just, I haven't paid enough attention to it. And I, I did watch, um, a little while ago, I watched, uh, uh, Guns, Nerds, and Steel do kind of like a little video on 21 but oh crap i did it again oh we're lucky we are so lucky <laughs> that is so easy to do oh man oh man all right you guys nothing happened nothing to see here move along if you guys say i did that again i'll deny it <laughs> we can't see a damn thing anyway um because the weather just turned shit so Okay, well, we recovered from that thing that actually never happened. Um, anyway, what were we talking about? Oh, yeah. So, yeah, I, I mean, I, it's, it's been such a long time since I even watched that video. I don't even remember exactly what all the new features are going to be. All I, all I do remember is that I thought to myself, okay, well, that's kind of cool, but, it, you know, nothing seems really substantial in the update from what we already have in Alpha 20. Uh, to the point where it is taking them a year and a half to get it to us kind of thing. This is not good. I cannot see Jack diddly squat. I mean, I can kind of make out some terrain a little bit, but stupid snowbound. We're flying in a whiteout. Okay, we're over a building there. That's a one of those lookout fire tower thingies. But we know there's a, a town or something over here. Larry the Lumberjack. Hate that guy. He's a real bastard. Okay, so why don't we kind of head north-ish? I think that's the mountain we were kind of flying over, which means, hey, we got a cold resistance of one. I guess we, I guess we haven't spent much time in the snow biome in this series, have we? Oh my goodness. Um, I don't want to go too far from this area because I know that town is really close by. I just cannot see anything. I'm kind of going a little bit of a circle here. Hmm. We do seem to be in the in a valley of sorts. There's a bear. I I could look at the map really quick, but we'll 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 lose altitude if I stay in the map for too long. Let's just look at it real quick. Okay, this is... Yeah, okay, so we want to go this way. 
Um, I don't think this is a, it is a city. Definitely not a city. It might be a small town. But it's just right over this direction, I think. Come on, son. Come out. You're screwing me up. We have a bit of a road here. All right, why don't we, why don't we land? Because we can use this little runway to take off. All right, let's look at the map. Yeah, you know what? Um, I guess we go due north and see if this road opens up. Because this is all I really saw, and I. It's just a it's just a POI. Let's look at the POI real quick. Yeah, it's just a one of those tower thingies. Don't really care about that so much. While we're on the ground though, we might as well refuel. How much fuel did we use? Uh fuel refuel. Alright, we didn't we didn't quite use half. So that's pretty good fuel economy. I don't have any mods on this either. Oh, you know what? We should have I should have looked to see if I had like a fuel extender mod. I know I have some of that kind of stuff. Let's just kind of stay down low and follow this road for a little bit, but I, I have a feeling like there actually isn't anything out here. It's just that POI. All right. Let's get up before these My senses have picked up something. guys start attacking us here. So this road... Okay, so the road leads... Oh, that's a highway. Okay. Interesting. Okay, let's, let's drop down here for a minute. Okay, so it's the highway that loops down and around and yeah it's just going to go up to up to here and then intersect with this highway here so i'm pretty sure there isn't anything significant down here other than a couple of pois so what we're going to do is we're going to take off again and we're just going to kind of head north and go up the western border of the map let's do it Get a little altitude. Man, I wish this wasn't foggy right now. It's like the worst possible time for it to be foggy. Is what it is, I suppose. I can try and stay low, but it doesn't help a whole lot. And plus, we run into trees, too. Okay, let's take a quick map peek here. I'd like to be a little more this direction. All we can really do at this point is, is just keep flying north and occasionally looking at the map to see if we missed anything significant. I see something, some kind of terrain up ahead here. Uh, it also looks like a tower of some sort. Yeah, let's take another map look. Oh, we got a highway there. Okay. Life is a highway. Gotta be careful or get a copyright check. Singing a little bit of a Nebraska Flats there. Okay, we got... Ooh, okay, we got a building. A significant building here. What is going on? Look at the map. 
All right, we are definitely in. I've got a bad feeling about this. A... Oh, you know what? This is the top of uh, what you call it, isn't it? The Higashi Tower. This is the top of the Higashi. Let's take one of these now and run away. And then reload this while we're running away. I'm hitting my copter. All right, so we got ourselves into a little bit of a pickle. So what else is new, right? This is actually a good spot to hang out, though. They can't really get to us. Um, in our, I think it was in our vanilla series, I, I came here right at the end of the series and I really liked this, um, what they did with the top of the Higashi here. Incoming enemy, prepare for conflict. It would be, it's a neat, kind of a neat place to live, um, you know, just with this penthouse that they have up here. Um, but if we have a Higashi here, that means we have a, a, a city of sorts, which is very good news. All right, let's take our honey. And we have an abrasion, so uh, let's take that. Do we have any points to spend? No, we don't. Okay. And I think we're about in as good of a shape as we can be. We can take a health bar, too. That knocked that down to 30 seconds. Excellent. Okay. I kind of messed up my gyro. Oh, no, I didn't kind of mess it up. I really messed it up. Well, that damage is almost exclusively from me shooting it, which wasn't very smart. Uh, all right. Now, what, <laughs> what do we do about this? I think what we can do is uh, grab all of this out of here, and then we'll just pick the gyro up. Um, I don't. Do I have any repair kits on me? I don't think I do. That wasn't good. Okay, so let's uh, pick it up. And since we're here, I think we probably cleared all the Zeeks out of the out of here. At least most of them. Yeah, this is this is a place I would really like to have a base, just kind of a nice fun base. Um, having it in the snow biome though isn't particularly appealing. But it's already got, you know, a bunch of crop plots set up that you could use to to grow your crops. And it's just, it's got a fireplace there, a sink. It's a very neat POI. I, I love what they, you know, what they did with the Higashi here in Alpha 20. So, yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to say we probably cleared this top floor out. Plenty of places, like I said, for garden, and it's all, you know, organized and, and neat looking and the design of it and everything. There's the, the dog. Okay, well, um, let's go all the way to the top and see if there's enough room for us to launch back off of here. Oh, are we going to have another group of nasties up here? We got the fat loots up here. My senses have picked up something. Oh, shit. Yeah. Get up. Yeah. One at a time. One at a time, please. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, let's uh, get out our old faithful friends here. Did 
Oh, it's nighttime. Yay. Hey, come over here, dude. Okay, he did. He did too. Okay, did we get them all? Make sure we're all reloaded here. And we are in good shape health-wise. You know what though? Why don't we... Why don't we lag? Okay, now we're done lagging. Let's have some pears because it's not used in a recipe. I don't remember if miso is or not, so let's just leave it. Um, let's eat one of these. Uh, no, miso is not used in a recipe, so we might as well eat that too. Just to get a little bit of health back here. And that should have cleared everybody off the roof, I think. Are there still more sleepy sleeps down there? Is that just a dead body? Yeah, those are just, uh corpses except for the dog okay any of that stuff lootable that is okay let's get to the fat loots are these oh these aren't the actual fat loots because they're not um there's no locked chest that we have to open nice very nice uh, medical supplies there. Hmm. An S-level hunting rifle. Okay. And, oh, impact razors. Uh, do I even have those? I don't know if I have those yet. Uh, I don't. Fantastic. I've noticed mods are a lot harder to come by in Undead Legacy than they are in vanilla. Okay, good. And we got an antibiotic if we get infected again. Just out of curiosity, let's compare this rifle with this one. Yeah, ours does 3.6 less damage, but it's better in every other way. So that's not a significant um, enough change for me to, to consider switching over. All right, I'm just looking to see... I don't remember exactly where the fat loots are in in the new Higashi, uh, but they're not obviously not up here. Are they in here somewhere? We already kind of came through here. Oh, here they are. Okay. All right, and that opens that door. Huzzah! Okay, uh, do I have eye candy on me? I do not. We do have our our luckies on though, right? Yeah, okay. Well, that's as good as it's going to get then. Okay, a little ammo action. Weapons bag. Shoddy messiah crate. Semi trigger, okay. Crack a book. Chance for a schematic, maybe? Uh, yeah, we'll take that. Unuse it. Uh, um, because I think the end of the Great Heist... Oh, we just made it to the end of the Great Heist. Fantastic. I think we get something pretty decent for that. I just don't remember what it is, so let's take a look. Uh, collectibles. Great Heist. You are here. No. Where are you? Right here. 25 to lockpicking and learn how to craft lock lockpicks. Increase bobby pin and lockpick durability. That's probably the biggest. Well, the 25 lockpicking is nice too, but the durability is the biggest thing on that. So, yeah, that, that's a really good one to get to the end of. So, yay us. Uh, all right. So, does that mean we can open this now or do we still need the thingamadoodle? No. 
<laughs> we still need the thing of doodle. We're so close though. Look at that. So close. All right. So let's take a jailbreaker. Not too much longer than we won't have to carry these around anymore. They're still probably worth carrying around because they also increase uh, durability as well. So. A lever action rifle. Ooh, that's different. Eliana's map with a key on it. That must be an undead legacy thing because I've never seen that in vanilla. If you're reading this note, then the odds are I'm not around anymore. Instead of letting my stashes of supplies go to waste, I'd like to have them in my location on the map. Okay. Um. Sure, why not? Let's do it. Where's that? Okay, good. It's in the direction we more or less want to go anyways. However, excuse me, I would like to at least open up this city and see, you know, how big is big it is and what else is here. The problem is I can't see a damn thing right now because of the fog. And the other thing that we have to figure out here is how we're going to get back in the air because that, that um, landing pad up there is very small. We might have to build a ramp, which we could do. Yeah, here, let's get rid of all this stuff. Hello? Hit it. There you go. You know, I just want to see... Yeah, this would be probably a good end. Probably the best end, in fact, to, to try and get out of here. So, what I'm going to do is... Well, you know what? We probably don't need to build a ramp. We can probably just break these these guys. Here, we'll just use this. That should work. I think we want to be facing this direction. There we go. Okay, so let's refuel you. And yeah, the city is definitely going to be in this area here and it's pretty close to this this town it's just in the snow biome man I, I do not like the snow biome mostly because I don't care about the cold and it's a great place to hunt it's the best biome to hunt in but you just can't ever see anything because it's you know it's always foggy and snowing and it just sucks or most of the time it is but um most likely this is the tallest building here because we would probably be able to spot other taller buildings if they existed just can't really tell right now because of the the lack of visibility so i'll tell you what we're gonna do let's let's go do that buried treasure and then maybe we'll luck out and it'll it'll clear up and we can come back and, and take a look and see how substantial this city actually is. Now, if we had a Higashi in that northeastern city, which is in the forest, um, a city in the forest can be kind of rare. Oh, we're in the desert already. Okay. Oh, good. Now we can see it. Okay. So, yeah, the Higashi is definitely the, the tallest building. But there, you know, there's some other stuff definitely in that town that we could check out POIs and whatnot I'm sure there's a trader around too it would, it'd be good to locate the trader but the problem is like I said as soon as we go back in the snow biome we're not gonna be able to see jack shit so let's uh let's just head to the treasure looks like it might be up on that butte there it's 
A pretty small city, but it is a city, nonetheless. Does it have a light? I don't think so. Don't hit the E key. Whatever you do. circle here. That's good enough. Okay. I've got a bad feeling about this. Nurse Nancy, what are you doing with feral businessmen up here? And, oh, and you, you guys got like a whole bunch of stuff going on up here. I'll let you guys define what stuff actually means. I'll be completely silent on the topic. Get out of here. Okay, let's um do get see if we can get a a poison gland. No, we didn't get a poison gland from him. We got a spidey. He did. All right, I'll grab that, and uh, let's see if we can find ourselves a treasure. I'm going to switch over to this, wake up a bunch more zombies. I hear footsteps. Let's see what we can find. I'm moving this direction. Hey! Quit bumping me! Okay, can you shoot? Good lord. They're just bouncing up and down. We have ourselves a concussion. We're gonna fix that right now. And an abrasion. Let's fix that. and then cut the rest of the time in half with one of these. Okay, we're in pretty good shape. We are heavy. Um, I really don't care about, oh shit, about that. Okay. We don't need meat, we don't need cans. Uh, we don't need scrap iron. We can scrap that, I suppose, and this. Uh, we want to keep the book. Don't care about that. Oh, the sand, yeah, we don't... Actually, you know what, though? I do kind of need sand, but... This is not the time to be getting sand. Okay, so something else is trying to get to us from over there, but we'll just wait. I've got a bad feeling about this. It's gonna be right there. That's embarrassing, man. A crawler got a hit off on us. Oh shit! Another one did. It's really embarrassing. Doubly embarrassing. You know what's better than a double? A triple. Hit us. There we go. We got a triple. Okay. I'm a completionist. I've told you that guys that before, right? What's that? Oh, it's an ambulance. Okay. Do we need our thingy? No, we don't. Okay. We have a zombo coming in.
Looks like we got multiple zombos coming in. Anyone else? I think we're good. Very nice. Eliana's... Who's Eliana? A chest armor mod. A silver locket inscribed with Jillian, forever my daughter. Aw. Wow, look at that. It gives us one, plus one fortitude and 8.1 loot bonus. That's pretty nice. Uh, chest armor. Modify. I'll take it. Right on. That's good stuff, guys. That's really good stuff. Uh, we got... And we got another diamond. Uh, the backpack. Let's see. That's a 25.2 space backpack. This is a... Oh, yeah. That is much better. Okay, so... There we go. We got an, an improved backpack mod, too. I think we can only put those on our on our chest thingy. That was a very nice treasure. And, uh, Eliana, whoever you are, appreciate it. You're probably dead. Or maybe you're a zombie. Maybe I've already killed you again. But... We appreciate it nonetheless. Okay, guys. Um, so let's see here. We know we've got a... a the, the, I don't think this is a city. I think that's a town, but it's a good-sized town. So I guess what we should probably do is keep heading north. We know this town is here, so we can always come back here later. And I'd like to do that in the daytime anyways. Uh, and uncover it, you know, look for waypoints, look for the trader, that sort of thing. But I think what we'll do is we'll continue heading north just to, you know, uncover anything else that might be up along this way. And then we'll head east. We'll get to this town here, and then we'll explore this town and get it uncovered. Once that's done, I think we've done a pretty good job of uncovering the map. I mean, there's still a lot of fog of war, but, you know, this is just wasteland here. And, um, you know, I may, maybe I suppose what we could do is fly south through here just to see if, if, if there's perhaps another city or a town that we could uncover. But um, I'll feel pretty good, you know, about the exploration that we've done of the map by the time we get done doing all of that. However, we are out of time in this episode, so we're going to just pretty much pick up where we left off right here in the next episode. I'll have to figure out, you know, how to get off the ground again, uh, but that shouldn't be too difficult to do. And, uh, yeah, then we'll go from there. So, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.